Hey guys, this is Nibin Prince and I'm back with you with another video. In this one, I'd like to bring to your attention this awesome topic and it is stop praying and start doing. We tend to have a fantastic, fantastic prior life. But what we don't have to go with that is some actions. That's where action stops. We pray, but no action. We don't follow pursuit with what we pray about. We see, we can use it from the biblical standpoint where we have great men and maybe women in the Bible days when they were praying. Take for example, David. When David was going up against the Philistine, he went out and he's praying constantly. And he asked God again, and God says to him, listen up, you keep praying. The answer is with you. Go forth and do what you got to do. So most of the time, all of us in our own special prayer life, we pray and we, we gotten or received all the answers to our prayer, but we lack more precision in terms of action. And that's where we lack sometimes. And that's where we don't see the, the strength or the, the manifestation of our prayer because our prayer is awesome. It is great, but it cannot just be great all by itself without any action or without any result. Because we all pray for a reason, whether we're giving thanks or we're asking to um, enter to break for certain things or opportunity to open up to us as well. But we cannot just stop there at just pray. We have to follow pursuit with some actions. And that's where mass majority of believers, whatever they believe in, that's where they, they, they stuck right at that level where it, I just pray, but there's no action that comes with the prayer. Take for instance, somebody open a door for you. Prayer is like a way opener. If the door is open by someone for you, then simply mean you have to go through. So the same thing with prayer. A lot of times the door of the opportunities that we pray about is open, but we're scared enough to just walk through the open door or whatever that situation is, we're scared to take up authority role in that situation. Take case in point again, if you was asking for a job opportunity to come by, you just know, so sit inside the house and keep praying. You have to start to get online, do some job research online, get some CVs, either email it over, or you just get out there, send it out to different um, business places, and hope and pray back in return that you might get a phone call for an interview. So you have to know that there are other level or other stage to take with prayer. Next again, prayer to me is like a sandwich. You got the bread, but you ain't got no ingredients. So to me, the action and the result is the ingredients are gonna come together to make the bread into a sandwich because a bread by itself, it ain't called a sandwich. It's just a bread, it's just a loaf, it's just a slice of bread, but you cannot call it a slice of loaf. Sorry, you cannot call it a slice of sandwich because you don't got that ingredients to call it what it is. So most of the time, our prayer life is missing those key ingredients, which is the action, you know, the persistent and all of those stuff to make our dream and our reality come through when it comes to prayer life. So yes, the topic is very relevant, like stop praying and take more action, which means you can simplify your praying, reduce it, because a lot of times our prayer is even answered before we even ask or even pray anyhow. You know, so, but sometimes we just stop there and say, yes, I hope and pray. Yeah, we can hope and pray all day comes, but we have to take action on our part as well, because it's necessary for us to take action. You know, we cannot just stick there and hope and pray things might fall into our laps. It does not apply like that for mass majority. For the 1%, it might, but for the the rest, 99% of us here on earth, we have to take some action on our path as well. Whether on a spiritual level or a physical level, we have to take some form of actions. So this video is for those people which are not seeing a lot of result, are not seeing any action on their prior life where are no result A, you know what I mean, showing up for what you're praying about. Start take some actions and then prior and action will start give you result. Okay, it's as simple what it is. You cannot just wait there for action without you know just because you talk a few words into praying or you meditate and think. Yes, it can happen. I'm not gonna like criticize that method. It can be done, but what's important sometimes is the action that are the follow through. We have to follow through with the words which have been answered and get some result in our life and also in our community as well. You know, so we have to take some action like that. So these are my few words up in this one topic. Feel free to check out my other videos which are here on my channel as well. And thank you very much guys to tune into this video as well. And if you can resonate with this video, please give me a thumb up as well. And also give me a share as well with friends and families as well. And thank you very much guys. If you hit the subscription, I would appreciate that very much as well. So this is my take up in this one topic. God bless you.